Ladies and gentlemen, I love this guy. He was the host of Dirty Laundry Live. It's Lawrence Moody! The other night, uh, my wife and I were getting ready for bed. That's right, getting ready for bed. Now, that statement in and of itself makes me want to blow my fucking head off. <laughs> We were getting ready for bed. We turned the lights off downstairs and we'd gone upstairs together and cleaned our teeth. Lulu had put her peeled headband on and was cleansing and toning before she moisturised. I'd put on my large T-shirt because I get sweaty at night. <laughs> I put on the bedside lights and opened my book to the page where I'd finished it the night before. We were nearly ready for bed. In fact, Lulu was in bed putting on the eczema cream <laughs> on the cracks between her fingers. <laughs> Rub it in, you itchy bitch. <laughs> Rub it in. Come on, give me a hand job with your sandpapery hands. Come on! <laughs> Exfoliate me! Not I wrapped my young bride's legs around my hips and straddled the stairs and nailed her against the wardrobe door. No, we were getting ready for bed. I can't carry her upstairs. I've got an L45 disc issue. <laughs> <laughs> I said to her, do you know, I think that I've experienced something similar to the pain of childbirth. And she said, I can listen to that. You can feel the hate radiating right there. Because <laughs> all the men just abandoned me, just went, no, mate, you're on your own. <laughs> just silence. Well, fuck you guys. You just went. <laughs> and all the women just went, don't you even. <laughs> don't you even try and own that. I'll tell you why. I have. I think, experienced the pain of childbirth. <laughs> Give me a moment. In October last year, my wife uh, went overseas on business and she took our youngest child with her. And uh, so I was left to my own devices. And left to my own devices, I bought a 30-pack of cocktail frankfurts, the little ones, the Savaloys, <laughs> case of beer, and I lived on a diet purely of cocktail frankfurts and beer. <laughs> Netflix. Boiled up the cocktail frankfurts, sores, oh, my idea of heaven. <laughs> Repeat day after day. On day four, I started having severe contractions. <laughs> I thought, this is happening. This is, this is on. I rang the hospital, they wouldn't admit me because I hadn't done the prenatal classes. <laughs> And at about 9.30 that night, I gave birth to a small German boy <laughs> by the name of Fritz. His birth weight was about 2.3 kilos. I didn't tear. And you know, girls, just after you've given birth, that wave of euphoria, all the endorphins come in and you just forget the pain and you're in that euphoric state, but I did actually have that euphoria because although tears were streaming down my eyes, <laughs> the sound that Fritz made when he hit the water <laughs> made me piss myself laughing. He just went, <laughs> doink, ka -ba -dung. Oh. and water came up over the top and <laughs> hit the toilet floor. And I just laughed and laughed. And then I, I pushed the button and sent him to an orphanage. <laughs> Thanks very much. Have a great day.